Welcome back guys to another video. Today we're going to be probably working on a unique vehicle that I actually like. Um, it's back engine, which is odd uh, because this is probably the first engine I found in this game that's back engine. Um, because we have rotary and front engines, not back engines. Um, yeah, you guys can see me like this. Um, Make sure you guys stay tuned for my fluff news video because I have to share some things with you guys. Um, very stormy today. Um, also, Sunday, if you don't have a go, he still doesn't have a mic. I was trying to play farm some with him, but he must have been just playing uh, Forza. Game takes a while to load. Here we go. Now, this is the car I'm talking about. And I was looking around when I got this, I'm like, well, you know, all the works will be in the front. I went to the front, and the only thing there is the battery. So you guys read that. Um, um, I noticed that some people are actually getting into this game, which is nice. Uh, I play on normal. Um, on my other profile, I do have it on sandbox mode where everything's unlocked. But, uh, I like playing on normal. Okay, I'll show you the front bumper is missing that. That's how it came. Like I said, I went here and I'm like, that's where, where's the engine? And I'm looking back here, like, uh, that's odd, that's strange. Got to remove the cover here, and voila. Here is the engine. I believe most of the work isn't on the engine, if I remember correctly on this one. So you can tell the engine's not even rusty. So tires. Um, I did unlock the fuel. Um, I'm working on another video because I did hit level 20, I believe it is. It was a very old car work on that one. That one's pre that was pretty cool working on that one. Um, When school starts, um, hope to make more videos for you guys, because, you know, I don't have school, so, probably be the same amount I'm doing right now for you guys. Let's see, uh, got one bad. Let's try fuel compression. And also the little icons, you know, like little gauge moving at, it's random. Because if you do it twice, you won't get the same, what I have found, you won't get the same, like, where the needle ends up, or like, stuff like that, so. Okay, a couple bad right there. This one's a little confusing when you do it, because in the back you're so used to, I'm like, you don't get vehicles like this so often, so I'm so used to going to the front to get things, you know, like engine parts in there and aft shafts and that, so I'm like, where is it? And I'm like, oh, yeah, it's in the back. I haven't gotten into interior yet. That would be cool to do one of these vehicles where you have to do, like, full re re rucks that restore the whole interior. That would be cool. As you can tell, everything is yellow. I believe it's, if it's 40... 42% or higher, you don't have to repair it. Like, when you scan your then it says like 45, it won't pick up as a broken item most of the time. Yeah, that's bad. Fuel filter? I mean, air filter? That's bad. How about the clips? Can I get the clips? Give me a little clips. There we go. That's okay. That one's okay. This one's okay. And that one's okay. Okay. Let's see. Check this out. Let's can't do that. Half chance. I mean, probably gotta check it up more. Probably. Let's see.
Sometimes you just gotta go outside a vehicle because sometimes it gets bugged. I did take part of the engine a little bit because I didn't know if like the blocks damaged or stuff like that. But most of it, I'm pretty sure it's not injured, but it doesn't hurt to, you know. You get extra XP, so it doesn't hurt to do it. At the end of the video, I would show you like this view of what everything is wrong of the vehicle, what's red and what color everything is and that. That'll be at the end of the video. Um, we have got some new mods on farm soon. Nothing exciting. I really want to get seasons. I mean, seasons, you know, comes out. Really, really want that to come out, but got a lot of bugs to fix though. So. And whoever, if you guys are playing this game, always double check because you know you get the crates. Always double check you don't have parts in inventory that are higher quality because if you do put higher quality parts on the vehicle, you will get more money. I know a stat, and uh, you also save money too because you already got the part; you don't have to pay for it. So. Just selling the stuff that's in the other vehicles. Still working on my Jeep. Um, I got the engine to crank over and actually drive. So, it's pretty good. I did get a military one, but I sold that one because for some reason when you buy the Jeeps, all the engines are broken. So, I was gonna use it for spare parts, but at least when I get the paint booth, that's my major thing I want to get is the paint booth. In the dyno. The dyno seems pretty cool. Oh, do we actually have a dyno on this one? I actually don't know about that one. I'm pretty sure we do. Well, that's gonna be it. Um, at the end, like I said, I'll show you. Well, actually, it's coming up, so I'll wait. Hey, there. Did I think I put the video on backwards? Oh, I might have put the video on backwards. Sorry, guys. Let me just see. No, I did not. Okay. I was worried I put it backwards. So here's an overlay of most of the stuff that's red on this vehicle just gonna scan the rest and that is gonna be it guys and see you in the next video which is our fluff news video and see you all in the next one ta-da bye thanks for watching make sure you hit that bell icon too